Hello fashion sewers. In this video tutorial I'm going to be showing you how to insert gathered sleeves. I'm Colleen Julie and this is Fashion Sewing Blog TV. The first thing you need to do is sew the gathers into the sleeve head as I have done here. I've done a video tutorial so please click on the link below in order to get the help for sewing gathers. Now this is a sleeve I'm going to be setting into the armhole and I'm going to show you what to do next. On my sample here, do make sure that you work on the wrong side of your garment and then the right side of your sleeve. And then I'm going to insert the sleeve into the armhole, like so, and then be right side to right side. And then I'm going to first of all match up the underarm seams and then I'm going to pin all the way around. So I put the first pin in. Let me just make sure that sleeve is in. And then I'm going to match up my balance mark notches. A single one there means it's the front of the garment. So you need to make sure the front of the sleeve is matching up with the notch or the balance mark and there's two making sure that they match up for the back of the garment and the back of the sleeve and then the next one to position is the top of the sleeve is going to the shoulder seam and put a pin in place there and then it's a case of making sure you're happy with your gathers and then it'll be a case of pinning all the way around I have now pinned my sleeve into position. Remember I started matching up the underarm sleeves and then the notches, front and back, front and back, and then the shoulder to the point of the actual sleeve head. And then the next step is to make sure you're happy with the placement of the gathers. And then you put your pins in as you go. And then you're ready to take it to the sewing machine. You can baste if you wish but it's quite easy just to pin, put as many pin as you feel is comfortable for you and then take them out as you sew. I'm going to start stitching at the underarm seam of the sleeve and it's 1.5 centimetres, five eighths of an inch I believe. Mm. I'm going to pull my pins out as I go, turning my work. You're making sure that you're working inside of the sleeve so that you can actually see the gathers and it may feel a bit awkward or a bit tricky, but just take your time. Pull your pins out as you go. I'm, I'm approaching the gathers now. Let's separate those threads a little. Now, I'm making sure that when I come to the two rows of stitching, I'm going to be sewing quite close to the first row here because I'm going to remove that row of stitching so that will be actually stitching on the seam line the one that I'm doing now and the first row is just slightly outside of the actual seam the seam allowance so I'm going to continue all the way around and then I'll take you back to my work surface and then you can see what it looks like the sleeve is now set in. I'm happy with the gathers on the actual sleeve. And now I need to do is pull that to the front and you should see a nicely inserted gathered sleeve. I'm really happy with that. Yep, those gathers are really lying the way I want them to do. Now this row of stitching here, the gathering stitch, is what needs to be removed. And all you need to do then is just get your stitch unpick or unpick or whatever you call it and then just remove the stitching. Here we have the setting gathered sleeve. I hope you found this video tutorial helpful. If you have any comments or queries please put them in the comment box below 